Hello guys, I'm back with another new tutorial and today I'm gonna show you how to make this presentation slide in just PowerPoint. So without wasting your time, let's start creating. Here I have already taken a blank slide. So first to change the background color, go to design, click on format background and from here I will change the background color. Now close it, go to home, pick a rectangle shape, drag it over the slide. Now go to format, click on shape fill and change the color. Then again go to shape outline, make no outline. This time pick a top rounded corner rectangle, drag it over here, increase the roundness a bit, rotate it and place it in the exact middle of this rectangle. Now again change this color and remove the outline. After that pick a text box, drag it over this small rectangle. Here I'm typing the letter A, select the text, change the font to dagger square, increase the font size to 48 point, change the font color and make it center. Now place this text box in the exact middle. Now we need to select these two and press Ctrl G to group them together. Then press Ctrl A to select all of these and holding Ctrl Shift drag it to left. Now change this color from shape fill. Again holding Ctrl Shift drag it to left it will be duplicated. Again change this color. I am doing the same thing for the last time. After doing so, you just need to organize this smaller group of shapes. That's why I am taking them a bit upward and then change the letter and its color. After changing all the letters, we will have something like this. Now we have to group them together one by one. So first select this two, press Ctrl G to group. Again select this two, press Ctrl G to group. Do the same for this one and also for this one. So now we have 4 different group of shapes. From here select the first one, go to format, click on the small icon, go to effects and set the shadow preset offset right. Change the transparency to 49%, size 100%, blur 20 point, keep the angle 0 degree and distance 7 point. Here you can see that a shadow has been added on our first element. Now select the second one, add the same preset, change the transparency to 49%, blur 20 point, distance 7 point. Like this way, we have to add the same shadow on the other elements. After that, press Ctrl A to select all of these and place them to the left side. Now from here, first bring this one to the right side. To save your time, in this tutorial, I'm not gonna show you how to make these infographic elements. So I'm just copying and pasting them. Place it here. Holding the control button, select this two and press control G to group. Now right click on it and send it to back. Then bring the second one to the right side. And from here, I'm copying this element and pasting it over here. Now place it here, select this two, press Ctrl G to group, right click on it, send it to backward, again right click on it, send it to backward once again. Now bring the third one to the right, copying this chart, pasting it over here. Now select this two, press Ctrl G to group, right click on it and send it to backward. For the last time, bring it to here, again copying this element, pasting it over here, select this two and press Ctrl G to group. Again place all of these to the left side and now we'll add the animation one by one. First select this one, go to animation, click on add animation from motion path select lines, from effect option select right. Now drag this red dot to the right, keep it on click 
and duration 1.25 seconds. Now select the second one, click on add animation, select lines again, from effect option select right, drag this red dot again, set the duration 1.25 seconds. Now select the third one, click on add animation, select lines, from effect option select right, drag this red dot to the right, set the duration 1.25 seconds again. Now for the last time, select this one, click on add animation, select lines from effect options, select right, drag this red dot and set the duration 1.25 seconds. After that, from our previous slide, I'm just copying these text boxes and pasting it here. And we are done. Here our presentation slide is ready. You can download this template for free. I have given the download link in the video description. If you have enjoyed this tutorial, make sure like and subscribe this channel. And don't forget to share with your friends. Hope to see in the next tutorial and thanks for watching.